The Cedar Rapids downtown farmers market returned for its 18th season this morning. This year, nearly 200 vendors are taking part in the market. KCODTV9's Cole Crutzfield shows us how they're having to adjust to rising costs. So you're getting 12 and you've got five bills. Teresa Greider first started selling her baked goods as a way to help fund her son's trip to Germany over a decade ago. Since around 2016, she and her husband have had a stand at the downtown farmer's market, and they are one of a number of vendors that have seen costs go up over the last few years. Oh, every year there's something that's gone up in price. I can remember being able to buy eggs for a dollar a dozen. They went up as high as four or five dollars a dozen for store-bought eggs and for farm fresh eggs they were six or more a dozen. Some vendors say they've seen costs nearly double for basic ingredients vital to their businesses. So inflation's been uh, a major challenge over the past couple years. Actually, like a pallet of flour has gone from about $750 up to about $1,400. It has definitely impacted our business. Greider says she's gotten creative to keep costs down without sacrificing the quality her customers expect. My sister has a few chickens. I get eggs from her and wherever else I can get farm fresh eggs reasonably priced. While Greider says she's tried to limit how much rising costs impact your prices, she says changes are inevitable. Some, some of it does have to be passed on. I mean, things are just gone up, you know, with the cost of paying employees to work at these places uh, costs. So then it's passed on to us, and hence I have to pass it back on to my customers a little bit. In Cedar Rapids, Cole Crutzfield, KCRG, TV9 News.